Hey there, Twitter. Twitter? I meant to say YouTube. <laughs> Uh, uh, anyway, I'm back. I guess I f I'll feel a little less awkward every day when I talk to the camera, but I, it's just really weird for me. I'm sorry. Um, uh, I've never used a video editing software in my life, and so I got some help from my piano teacher who knows how to do that. Um, and I watched a lot of videos on YouTube, so thank you for those of you who are putting out tutorials and helping me, helping newbies like me. Um, so my plan is, I want to do, I mean obviously my talent is in music, and so I want to make, keep making music videos. Uh, but I want them to look better and to be shot better, and to give you, and to give you a little more insight into what it is that I'm actually doing instead of just shoving a video with no explanation or where I'm putting all the explanation into the description. Uh, the only problem is I only have this one camera other than, I guess I have my phone, I have iPad, I could figure something out, but I'm, I'm just not sure how to go about shooting oneself by oneself when you're playing and you only have one camera, but you're, you need to get different angles because you want to get the face, you want to get the hands, and I just can't imagine how you can do that without having multiple cameras. But maybe that's not a big deal. I think I need to go watch some more YouTube videos <laughs> about how people, and just watch them too, see how they're doing it. Um, the other thing I can't imagine is Having, it's like being watched during the process, a process that normally I do completely alone. Uh, it'd be like having somebody looking over my shoulder and, and I, it might be okay for a minute, but then I'd be like, stop looking at me, get out of my face and let me think. <laughs> Cause songwriting is something, uh, songwriting in particular. Playing is not so much, but when I play a cover song it's and I'm recording it, of course it'd be easier if nobody was looking because then I could do it a million times and get everything the way that I want it to sound. Um, where the hell was I going with this? Writing a song is the most intimate, private thing the most solitary thing that I do in my life. It's something I would, I have never, never allowed anyone to be a part of that process. There's been a couple of times when I've co-written and that even that was painful. Oh. You, you know what, you know how shitty your early drafts are and how basic and how dumb it all is. So my songs have always been usually a process of writing something that sounds normal and then you kind of alter it to screw it up a little to make it more interesting. And then, then that's where kind of the, the hooks start coming because it's something unusual and it grabs your ear. Oh, I remember. I had an idea if I wanted to make a video. Uh, to do a list of YouTube annoyances. This is so stupid. I'm sorry. But, um, so I have five YouTube annoyances. <laughs> five popcorn kernels. Listicles. At least that's what they're called in on the on the web in articles but uh i don't know what they're called on youtube but why is it that we have so many videos that are like five ways to do this and seven ideas for this it's just it just seems so gratuitous and it's the something that i'm going to be doing for this video okay number two number wait number four 
is clickbaity titles. Those videos where it turns out it's some something offensive and then it turns out that when you watch it it's uh, they're they're trying to say the exact opposite of what you were afraid that they were saying by the title. So you're like, oh, okay, he didn't mean it after all, or what? She sometimes uh, clickbait. I I get annoyed with that because it forces you. You're gonna you're getting all angry and worked up, and you want to lash out, and then they take it away from you because they were just pulling your leg, and you fell for it. <clears throat> Number five, four. Number three is calling the audience guys. This is like a, a huge YouTube tick that everybody goes, hi guys! And I, I hate to be that gal, but it's and maybe it's just because I'm from Texas and we say y'all here. But uh, can you just say guys and gals? Or that doesn't sound very cool. Um, you, you guys. You guys is less, you know, sexist. I don't like where this is going. Um, I'm going to move on. <laughs> Number two, okay, when you say, please let me know in the comments below what you think. So 90% of the time that I watch YouTube, it's on the Apple TV. And of course, when, you, when I'm seeing you on Apple TV and you're pointing downwards, you're pointing at the floor, dude. Look beyond your little world. And imagine the embedding that's going on on different platforms and devices. Uh, comments below doesn't apply to everybody. Ah, we're at number one. This one is the extensive pitches to get comments and likes and subscriptions. And I get it because this is how people make a living on YouTube. But it's just so, uh So I guess I'll uh, ask you guys to, even though I think it's kind of gross, but if you want to like wherever that is, or on the web, uh, go on your phone and find it. See, that's so much of a pain. They're not going to want to do that. Oh yeah, I was going to ask you to subscribe to my channel. I don't know why. Because I think I'm supposed to want that. I do want it. I want to be loved by you, just you and nobody else but you. Uh, and then what, what else is there? Uh, the liking, the subscribing, commenting. Got a comment on not here. I don't know. It might be there. It might be here. Uh, I'm so sorry. I just don't have a good train of thought to be able to compose what I'm saying on the fly like this. But I also don't want to write it all down. Do you often find that you have a lot of ideas, but do not know how to express to others in a clear and concise way? What, here's what I want you to let me know in the comments, wherever they are. What do you want to see here? What do you want from me? Uh, do you want, uh, would you like a cover tune? Because those are easy enough, kind of easy. Would you like me to, uh, like improvise on electronic instruments, of which I have a lot of them, and I have guitars, as you can see right there. Oh, if you want to, if you want me to talk, I can talk all day. I love to talk. 
it's just, you know, I might be awkward in front of the camera, but if you have story requests or if you want to know uh, the chords to one of my tunes, maybe, I mean, if you, like, I don't know how I would write it down and hold it up to the camera. No, I'd show you how to play it. Uh, do you want to know the story behind the making of some, of some, or the writing of some song, or do you want to know how we recorded it, one of the albums, or like, I know, I know what you really want. You really want me to have an album out with new, all new songs, ready and available to buy in on or to listen to sorry listen to for free on spotify uh i know you want new music for me studio recordings and i'm i reckon that'll happen uh but i just don't know how long that's gonna take to get to your hands and ears okay well, uh, I'm really grateful for all of y'all's support and um, hope to c come back with you soon with some better video. I want to make it one slightly bit better every time. Maybe I'm not sure how it's better this time. Maybe I'm talking a little easier. I don't know. Uh, but anyway, have a good day. Okay, bye.